if we can start showing our Islamic values, guys, we would take over the world. Think about this for a second. We're billions of people, yet we're not running the world. We're letting the dunya run us instead of running the dunya. Imagine we could run the dunya. We could run it however we want. But we have corrupt leaders. Leaders who are willing to let pornography enter their country on purpose. In amana upon us to spread the message of Islam. Remember that. It's, it's indebted upon you. It's indebted upon you to spread Islam. To give da'wah to LeBron James, it's indebted upon us to do that. Why not? To give da'wah to these people, why not? Why can't we be giving da'wah to them? That's what the nation of Islam was doing. Oh, brother, they're doing the da, but they're, they're doing kufr and all that. I'm not denying that, but at least they were more active than we are. Okay, we have the haq. What have you done about it? Way of life as Q, keeping it a hundred. Assalamu alaikum. I hope this is working. I hope this is working. Guys, LeBron James is an undercover Muslim. Did you know that? Did you know that? LeBron James is an undercover Muslim. So bet a lot of you didn't even know that. Some of you are like, SQ, have you seen a Shahada video? No. SQ has your friends or family confirmed someone that you know close to him that LeBron James is a Muslim? No. Then SQ, what the hell? Are... <sighs> You're just here to throw another person's name in your video, SQ? That's what you want to do, just throw another one. How can I think of another person I can mention in my video to get some clout? Maybe, that's definitely probably true. <laughs> mashallah, mashallah. But why shouldn't he be? Why shouldn't he be a Muslim, right? He might be a Muslim and not even know. I call him an undercover Muslim because I don't think he even knows that he's a Muslim. Have you ever met someone like that? That you met them and their character, their manners are so nice that you're like, man, if this only person was a Muslim. Instead of thinking if only this person was a Muslim, what if they are a Muslim but they don't even know? What if they're just so confused that when you explain Islam to them, they're like, yeah, that makes sense. One, I do that already. Two, I believe that already. So yeah. You see, when you give da'wah for long enough, going to people, talking to people from all walks of life, you realize something that... People can vibe with Islam more than we give them credit to. You understand? They can vibe with Islam in a better way than you and I give them credit to. They can. It just has to be explained to them. Like, yeah, that makes sense. Well, that makes sense. That makes sense. Well, if that all makes sense, then yeah, this is the truth. Right? But how will that happen if we're not actively providing that truth? This video is definitely sponsored and brought to you by Sindeed. These pants are from Sindeed right here. They're pretty fly. I got some Vapor Max. I don't know what they're called. But they make me look taller when I like them. And it was like a hoodie day today because it's going to rain later on. You ever had like a hoodie day that happened to you? Where you're just like, you just want to be a sweats and a hoodie. and like, But you still got to make it look good. You know, we're Muslims and we got to look good either way. But yes, LeBron James is an undercover Muslim. I believe it. I believe that if he were like explained Islam correctly in, in, in a way that vibes with him, in a language that he understands. Oh, it's cute. He speaks English. No, hold on. What I mean is, wait, someone's calling me? Hold on. This could be important. This is my real estate agent. You want to hear the conversation? Let's go. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum. What's going on, Izzy? I have two seconds, but listen, Izzy, I got to teach you something, man. I said, you know what? Did you realize I just said, Assalamu alaikum to you? Did you hear that? Actually, no, I don't, I don't, I don't believe so. That no. Means, uh, like, that's a good thing, right? Like, yeah, uh, yeah, it means may God's peace and blessings be upon you. That's what it means. Oh, okay, yeah. yeah. I've heard and then I'm supposed to respond by saying something, no? Yeah, well, do you know what you're supposed to say? Uh, hold on. Dava all day. Salaikum salam, salam. Not salam, it's walaikum assalam. Oh, wa alaikum assalam. Woo, man, is you you're a natural, bro. You're not. What's up, brother? How can I help you? What's up? Not good stuff. So I spoke to John. I I do believe you left. Yes. It's getting a little too personal. Okay. No. Uh, okay. Yeah. Okay. Wow, that's wonderful. That's so smart. Okay, we'll sort it out. We'll sort it out. Thank you so much. I appreciate you. Yeah. Oh, the the carpenter, the one who owns the house? 
Okay. I'll speak to my family about it. What did he say about the furniture? The, because he has some furniture in there. I don't know if it's going to fit in his bigger house. Sorry, guys. Yeah, I, I think they said something. His real estate agent said something about them leaving it behind. So, like, let us know if they are. Yeah, so let us know if they're trying to leave it because I'm not trying to pay for any of their stuff. But if they want to leave some of it, I, I won't mind picking. <laughs> Man, listen to me. The furniture should come with the house with that price. Come on now. Come on, Izzy. Come on now. Work your magic, baby. Come on now. It should come with that. You can make. I know you can make anything happen, my bro. Yeah, you know you got it, bro. There's a few things that we would want, like that leather sofa and all that. That's pretty nice. So there's certain things they could get rid of, but like there's certain things that I guess like if they had let us have our pickings, we could have. I got you. I'll find out from you. I could. I could find out in the next hour. I, in the next hour, I could get back to you. You got it, brother. Thank you so much. All right, bye. Man. Yeah, you heard. We're trying to buy a house. All right? We're trying to buy a house. Inshallah, it works out. If not, it's from the color of Allah. That's what you do istikhara for, right? That's what you do istikhara for. That's what this video was actually about. Some of you are like, SQ, you legit just had a conversation with someone on the phone this whole time. Are you going to cut this out, SQ? Please, I'm not going to cut it out. I'm not going to cut it out. This is the real world we live in, fellas and ladies who watch this. <laughs> May Allah bless you guys. <laughs> You know, LeBron James, going back to that topic, right? LeBron James was, is doing so much stuff for his community. Building schools, has organizations, giving back to his community. And we all know those are Muslim-like qualities. Those are Muslim qualities within himself. But let me give you some other uh, evidence over here that he's closer to Islam than we think. Like LeBron James, I think maybe that's the title of the video. LeBron James is closer to Islam than we, we think. He's closer to Islam than we think. He was the one who shared that video of Ali uh, Ibn, um, I forgot the brother's name. Uh, I forgot the brother's name. It, it, good brother, mashallah, I think from New Jersey or something. The one who, got, who, who stopped the fight from happening, right? Him. I think, if I'm not mistaken, LeBron James was the one who shared that link, shared that video that caused it to go viral. It was really LeBron James. He saw that. Those are the Islamic values. If we can start showing our Islamic values, guys, we would take over the world. Think about this for a second. We're billions of people, yet we're not running the world. We're letting the dunya run us instead of running the dunya. Imagine we could run the dunya. We could run it however we want. But we have corrupt leaders. Leaders who are willing to let pornography enter their country on purpose. Some of you like, you know, SQ, you know, oh, you, you spoke about Omar Suleiman and da, 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 defended him, but what about MBS? Are you comparing a monarch king who controls his kingdom and a lot of part of the world to someone like Omar Suleiman? I'm not going to even get into what he did was right or wrong. I've already said my stance on that. If you don't know what it is, you haven't clicked videos, I'm not going to honor that at all. Like, chill out. If you haven't done your research and to know what my stance is on that, keep to yourself. Stop letting the shaitan make up stories in your head. All right? You're comparing him to MBS? Someone who has the ability to, like, allow a Netflix, a whole fitna into their country? Music? Into Please. But we can't advise a, advise a Muslim ruler. Who said it's going against him? I'm not saying go against him. I'm saying advise that man. He needs some advice. All those people making videos about Omar Suleiman, make a video about MBS and advise him. He needs some advice, right? Not go against the ruler, not don't obey the ruler, not all those hadiths that you're quoting to me. Advise him. Is he, are you not allowed to advise him? What kind of person are you not allowed to advise? The same person who's going to be from his grave. He's going to be dragged up from his grave just like all of us. He ain't special. No one is special. LeBron James isn't special. He still has to stand in front of his Lord and give account for what he's done for his life. No one's special. I'm not special. MBS ain't special. LeBron ain't special. Special. No one's special. Everyone has to face their Lord. It's our responsibility. If we feel like we know something, it is a burden, a debt, an amana upon us to spread the message of Islam. Remember that. It's, it's indebted upon you. It's indebted upon you to spread Islam. To give da'wah to LeBron James, it's indebted upon us to do that. Why not? 
to give da'wah to these people? Why not? Why can't we be giving da'wah to them? That's what the nation of Islam was doing. Oh, brother, they're doing the da'wah, but they're, they're doing kufr and all that. I'm not denying that. But at least they were more active than we are. Okay, we have the haq. What have you done about it? Becoming like Bani Israel, we keep it to ourselves. Keep it to yourself. Jannah is only for us. Not for the kufar. We're in these kufar lands. Please. Dawah. You're giving dawah. You're going to give dawah? That's a quote from my podcast. That's a quote from a podcast that was said against me. And that's the true reason that podcast is not being released. That's the true reason. The true reason you want to know. It's not because of what my la 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 la. No. It's because the people on the other side of the camera looked dumb. But believe what you want. Believe what you want. Support who you want. It doesn't make a difference. Our job is to give da'wah, to educate people about Islam, the beauty about Islam, to protect them, to call them to the right path, have them protected from the hellfire. The same way that I would want to protect myself and my family from the hellfire, I want to protect LeBron James from the hellfire. I want to. Am I going to be able to? I don't know. I don't know. The title of this video is Switch Mid Video. Whatever I would like, I do it. That's what I want. If I want to pace back and forth, I'll pace back and forth. I want to talk about LeBron James. Tomorrow's video is about Billie Eilish. Be ready. Tomorrow's video about Billie Eilish. If I want to talk about someone, I'll do so. In the most positive, best, well-mannered way there is i appreciate you guys thank you so much for watching and uh listening to my rant and my rumble and uh this entire lebron james video i don't know the title of this video uh but i will say this if you made it to the end of this video i sincerely from the bottom of my heart appreciate you and love you it means the world to me tell me in the comment section below how do you like the audio quality of this i don't know I, I genuinely don't know does it sound different at each ear when i do this like does that sound i don't know i'll find out in post but this is too new i hope you guys are benefiting from this it took me some time i had to buy it It was quite expensive you know uh i'm not balling as much as you think i am but i have priorities to do and i'm trying to buy a house as you could tell so like i'm trying to watch out but the dava videos don't stop the airpod videos don't stop this saturday inshallah 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 trying to make a double video uh, a quiz a quizzing strangers for an iPhone that's what I'm doing this Saturday inshallah quizzing strangers for an iPhone I love and appreciate you all check out some of my other videos or don't or don't check them out um, yeah prioritize a lot don't prioritize me in my videos huh but it's been real guys thank you so much for watching I appreciate you nonetheless uh, may Allah SWT increase you and bless you and guide you all and until next time which is tomorrow inshallah I'm out